Great, so uh, today is gift day, everybody, and uh, that's a really important thing. If you're a visitor to Grace Church, uh, please just listen and enjoy. Uh, we don't want uh, money from you if you're a visitor today. Please don't think that. Uh, we don't have a collection or anything like that normally to emphasize that the gospel, the good news of Jesus, it's free. It's totally free. It's not something that we, we do for God. Uh, it's not something that we pay him back for. It's totally free. He gives us everything through Jesus, forgiveness, <coughs> eternal life, relationship with him. But if you are a regular, if you're regularly part of Grace Church, this is really important for you. It's really important for our church. It's important for your own walk with the Lord. And Sarah is our treasurer. And uh, Sarah's going to come and tell us uh, what Gift Day is all about this time around. Thanks, Sarah. Brilliant. Thank you. Ben said, if you're, um, this is just for members of, of Grace Church. So if you're visiting today, then please do just tune out. Um, we're... We're going to have a quick look at the numbers. As we do that, we remember that we're, um, we're not a business. Um, we're looking at money that's been invested um, for growing God's, God's kingdom. And we pray that we will use that and steward that money uh, wisely. But if we can have the slide up. Okay, so we, we're going to have a quick look just at the uh, financial forecast for um, 2021 and 2022. So this year and next year. Uh, and we've got some numbers that are based on basically what we what comes in, over the, what's come in over the last few months and what's been going out. So most of our uh, money comes from uh, regular giving, um, so people who kind of give month by month, um, and also some donations and one-off giving, and a little bit from rental where we use the building um, we, uh, for um, other organisations and they pay to cover their costs effectively. And then our main um, outgoings are um, staff, and that includes staff and accommodation, uh, the building, so um, keeping up, keeping the building, maintenance, that kind of thing. Much smaller amount on things like activities, or include things like church lunch, for example. Um, and then we also give um, a, 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 reg, a, a set proportion of our regular giving um, every uh, every year, and that money goes to church planting in the UK um, and abroad. So you'll see from this that our outgoings are currently quite a lot larger than our, our, our income. Uh, but wonderfully, that is covered by um, St. Ebbs um, Central. Um, and that's always been the plan that they would, um, they would support us uh, for around five, five years as we, we start. So effectively, that, that negative number at the bottom is what's given to us by um, St. Ebbs. However, we are looking to become financially independent probably over the next three years. And that's the reason for doing gift day um, today. So we're looking at how we can increase our income and our regular giving ideally um, so that we can get closer or get that negative number at the bottom a little bit lower. So we're looking at a target of £18,000 um, and it's a big number. As I said, ideally we want that to be in regular giving over the course of a year. So um, it will obviously affect our numbers next year rather than um, this year. Um, so we're asking um, uh, people who come along regularly to Grace Church um, to uh, prayerfully consider what they are um, giving as we have gift day um, today. Um, and if you're maybe quite new and haven't started uh, giving, then that would be a great time to, to think that through. We realise that current situation can be, um, can be hard uh, financially, current circumstances, and, and everyone's circumstances are different. So please obviously do think sensibly about what is right for you. Now, if you are a, a member or regular at Grace Church, um, then you should have seen in Pascaline's regular email um, a notice about how to give. There's a link there. It will go out in this week's email as well. Um, if you haven't seen that or you've lost the email, then you can also head to the website um, and there's a link to giving, I think, on the top right. Click there and that will take you to a form which gives you instructions about how to give. Um, do you, you'll see on that form there's a checkbox for gift aid. So if you are a UK taxpayer, then please do check that box. And it means that we can claim the tax back on the money that you give. Um, and that's quite a large amount of money. Sounds good. I realise that's been quite a lot of information very quickly. Um, if you do have questions um, about anything I've said or want to know any more details, then do um, come and uh, find me after the service. Very happy to, to chat some more. Um, 
but yeah, just as we finish, I guess we need to remember that ultimately this is, this is God's work and he will provide what he wants to provide. Um, so please do be praying for our finances. Um, there's lots to be thankful for um, in terms of what he's provided already, building, we've got the money for Pascaline's role um, from gift day last year and many other things. Um, and do be praying as well that we use the money that comes in uh, wisely and to grow God's kingdom. Thanks. Thanks so much, Sarah. Shall we uh, show our appreciation for all the work that Sarah does? Thank you so much, Sarah. We really appreciate it. Uh, we're going to start by praying for that right now as, sorry, Pascaline, as Joe um, comes to lead us in prayer. And just to say as he comes up, uh, you can find the giving form, do come, Joe, you can find the giving form on the website under the resources section. And if you haven't got access to the internet, there are some forms at the back. You can always post them in the letterbox there. Thanks so much, Joe. Great, let's pray. 